All right, so today we're diving deep into pop music, like really deep. Deeper than the glitter and the glam. Exactly. We're going to take a look at the crazy pressure that comes with fame, especially in this whole digital age. That's a whole different beast now. And, you know, to help us unpack all of this, we're focusing on Chaperone. A rising star, for sure. Yeah, you've probably heard her hits like Bitter or Good Luck Babe. Catchy tunes. Totally. But lately, she's been in the news for stuff that's, well, not really about her music. Right. It's more about, like, the behind-the-scenes stuff, the personal stuff. Yeah, and that's what we're going to dig into today. We've got this article. It's called Pop Star Showdowns and Red Carpet Realities. Sounds juicy. It is. And it really gets us thinking about what it's really like to be famous, especially yeah. when you're young, and how all that affects... Like your mental health. Yeah, because we often forget that these celebrities are real people with real feelings. 100%. So get this. Picture the premiere of Olivia Rodrigo's D.O.T.S. tour. Oh, I can only imagine. The excitement, the chaos. Total chaos. Cameras flashing everywhere. Reporters shoving to get the best spot. And then, right in the middle of it all, Chapel Road just straight up calls out a photographer. Whoa, really? On the red carpet? Right on the red carpet. And she wasn't subtle about it either. She basically said that this photographer had been disrespectful to her at the Grammys. Wow, that's pretty bold, you know, Girl. using that platform to address something like that. Right. It really makes you think about what celebrities usually have to deal with in those situations. And what's even crazier is that the article doesn't even say if the photographer apologized or not. Hmm. Yeah, it really makes you wonder about, like, the power dynamics at play there. Totally. And the thing is, this wasn't even the only time something like this happened. Oh, there's more. Oh, yeah. Just a couple weeks before that, at the VMA's pre-show, she got into it with another photographer. What happened there? Well, apparently, the photographer, like, yelled at her. Yelled at her? Seriously? Yeah. And, you know, Rome's talked about her struggles with anxiety before, so it makes sense that she didn't just let it slide. Definitely. Especially in that kind of environment. Later on, she talked about how situations like that just make her anxiety so much worse and how overwhelming the whole fame thing can be. It's a good reminder that these stars are human, you know? Yeah. And these weren't just little, like, moments of frustration for her. This stuff really got to her. And she ended up making a pretty big decision. What was that? She canceled two of her upcoming music festival appearances. Whoa, really? Yeah. She put up a post on Instagram explaining that she needed to focus on her health like mental and physical well-being. You know, that's a big deal. It's not easy to just cancel something like that, especially when you're on the rise. It's huge. And the response was incredible. Her fans were so supportive. That's amazing. It really shows how the relationship between artists and fans is changing. Totally. It seems like people are getting tired of this whole fake, perfect image thing. They want something real, something relatable. For sure. And Roan being so open about her struggles is inspiring. Especially for young fans dealing with similar stuff in their own lives. Right. So, like, what's the takeaway from all of this? Well, I think Rose's experiences give us a little peek into what it's really like to be famous in this digital age, you know, with social media and everything. It's intense. Super intense. All that scrutiny, the pressure to look and act perfect all the time. It's got to be exhausting. And her choosing to cancel those festival gigs to take care of herself, that sends a powerful message. It shows us that maybe, finally, being real is becoming more important than keeping up appearances. That's a good point. And this leads to an interesting question, you know, what does this shift say about what we expect from celebrities now and how we treat them? Like, will we be more supportive of them being open and vulnerable? Those are some things to think about, for sure. Definitely a new era for fame. Huge thanks to Chapel Roan for being so open about all this and reminding us that even pop stars are real people with real problems. And we're all human, right? <laughs> exactly. So go check out her music. It's awesome. And while you're listening, think about how her experiences connect to your own life, you know? It's all about those human connections. All right. That's it for our deep dive today. Until next time. See ya. Yeah, yeah. Chapel, right in front of you, please. Chapel, right in front of please.